What's up, everybody? Oxidize back here, and I gotta say, you're, you're you're putting some fire in my mouth when I say we are doing bows. We I'm doing two episodes right now, two videos of this bad boy right here. We're gonna go with the longbow. All right, I want the longbow because I like the E, the rain of arrows. I'm sure I'm gonna get a lot of comments being like, "Hey." Let me show you a bow build. Bring it on, brother. Bring it on because it's not going to be the last time we're going to see bows, but this may very well be the first time I really, really dig deep into bows. I did I did a little bit of bows in the very beginning, but nothing like this. So here's what I'm going with. I'm going with Deadly Shot for the damage and resistance uh, decrease. I'm doing Explosive Arrows where my next 10 explosive, my next 10 arrows will explode. I thought about maybe going Frost Shot, but I was like, let's try Explosive Arrows first with the damage. We're going rain of arrows because you have to and it's also a huge volley of arrows that just that, that that just hit pretty pretty good a little bit of music playing here i'm also going for the energetic which gives me more energy restore as you can see i don't have any energy regen here i'm just kind of oh i should have like really should have uh increased my durability here but it eh, should should be a good time i'm going hunter's hood i have a mage cow for backup uh but we're gonna go hunter's hood with retaliate because i think retaliate's fun mercenary jacket with bloodlust because i mean let's be honest here mercenary jacket's cheap and it, do it does what it needs to get done basically we're going stalker shoes this might be a little bit different stalker shoes has, has a blink and a damage increase so you can you're able to get out of trouble and do more damage alongside with it and other than that thedford cape poison potions and then bluefin tuna baby like i said we're in tier eight let's get started pop the tuna let's get going so it's 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 no um it, it, it's no secret let's be honest here that I, I i i don't do a ton of uh ton of bow bow-esque content all right no no secret at all all right speaking of it we are, we're actually having a little bit of trouble right here coming on through coming through Ooh, this, this is gonna be a long one fellas this one's gonna be a long one but can he do it? That, that that that's the question we're all asking. Can he do the unthinkable? Oh, down goes Yogi. All right, we're um starting off strong. I would say I'm surprised we didn't go down there. That was very easily downable material if we weren't careful. I don't know, man. I mean, we we're, we're, we are doing some damage here. To say that we're not is completely false. By the way. I, I, I don't want to be like, you know, I'm not going to be a hater on bows my entire life. They're, they're just, you know, I've been burned by them so many times. It's hard to be a a, a, a bow synthesizer. No, wait. Sympathizer. Am, am I saying that correctly? Synthesizer? No, that's not right. It, it's simp... Simp... Uh, you know what? Simp... Just, whatever. Whatever. I'm not going to say it anymore. Get out of there and hit him with the Q. GG's. All right, so yeah, let me know what you think of the build. Let me know what you think of the long bows in general. There, there's a couple of options you could have went with. I think normal bow might be okay, but I saw the AOE potential in the long bow and I was like, you know what? Let's give it a shot for a couple episodes. See what happens. All right, so far, so good. I, I You know, it's really gonna shine once we get to that first mini boss. You already know. You already know how this is gonna roll. We're gonna, we're gonna like steamroll the competition until we get to uh i don't want to do this maybe 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 retaliate an e that wasn't too bad we should definitely um blink out of here as soon as we're able to move all right blink out cue it up mm, still doing some damage here so we got to be careful yeah uh are we gonna live nobody knows actually yeah we are gonna live uh you know <laughs> we're doing better than i already expected because I'll, I'll be honest with you uh, item power wise we're at 839 we're, we're we're not stacked to the brim like i probably should be when i do these dungeons i never i never really am maybe maybe when i do swords but that's that's about it <laughs> it's also weird that it's a channel as well so i don't know how i feel about that honestly Ooh, you thought you was you, you just you just blink away don't know what to do with me okay so far i mean i uh, honestly surprised we haven't went down yet we are at the first mini boss though and we'll uh okay what okay you might be thinking why didn't you move he was dead he had zero health left 
Yet he comes back from the brink of death, one HP, knocks me out back at full health, just laughing at my face. I can't have too many of those, by the way. Let, and, and, and the main reason being is that we're already a little low on the old uh, health, or on the, on the equipment durability side. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't stand in those. All right, yeah, we are gonna retaliate here. Maybe even do some of that action. Yeah, the, 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 these guys, a part of the uh, the giants, really, really blow. I do not like those guys. All right, let's make some headway here. Uh, I don't want to aggro the uh, the mini boss yet. I'm not quite ready to fight it. We're gonna take care of this guy. Okay. Um, something you could look at instead of this build, maybe doing something with more attack speed, like hunter uh, hunter jacket. But eh, I, 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 that's all I gotta say about that. Eh. Oh, what a play. How are we doing right now? We're actually doing fairly well. I got to be honest with you. Uh, yeah, so, you know, honestly, retaliate might just not be worth it because you are trying to dodge pretty much every single bullet. We might move over to Mage Cow, actually, just because we do have a little bit of... Uh, because I, I, I honestly think that's going to be our play. 100%. I think after this fight, I think for the other bosses, we are gonna go for the mage cow plays. How are we, are we, are we doing good here? I, I, I don't, I mean, yeah, I mean, we're not dying. So, I mean, that's pretty amazing. Plus we got that going up. We have the mercenary jacket popping. I don't know, dude. I, I don't know. <laughs> it's, 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 it's I'm, you know, I'm not gonna try to be an expert on this. I legit just don't play with bows. So this is actually kind of a, a little bit of an eye opener for me. You know, like, it, don't get excited. I mean, you know, I'm not going to be pro bow. More, more, you know, most likely. Oh, I, I meant to change, by the way, to the... Uh... Oh, I don't know. I think for these small fights, retaliate may be better. But for, like, boss fights, I think I think you're... Oh, that really sucks. I think you're really looking for the uh, the mage cow. J just for that strong one-on-one -on -one type of damage. But I think I would rather not switch to it, though. Because I would rather be able to stick to one build at a time. That way I can come back again and try a whole new build. You know what I mean? You know, you know whenever we see long bows or bows in general again, I know I don't want it to be the same shmame type of stuff. I want it to be fresh, you know, fresh out the kitchen, something with ignition. You know what I mean? Okay, you're going down. Oh, dude, by the way, I, if y'all didn't see the second Great Axe video, highly recommend going watching it. It was our first piece of like, actual pogged out of my mind loot right there it was insane oh that actually cancels my uh that's just really unfortunate i did not think that would actually cancel my channeling that was uh too too bad uh are we gonna live through this questionable um maybe no i don't think we are yeah yeah you know you just sometimes you just know because we, we were just getting melted very fast there at spells, mob keeper stump effect hits you. Okay, I I have the combat log up just in case someone is foolishly enough to uh, maybe do some damage to the earlier mobs I left behind. A little bit pro tip, or like if if you're a smarter man than I am, or woman, um, you you probably want to leave behind some silver. So if they try to pick up some silver on the way, you're able to see that you're like someone other than your name is picking up the silver that's on the ground. Does that makes sense. Sure. Yeah, it makes sense. That's you, by the way. If you if you didn't know that, All right, you know I, I'm gonna I'm gonna leave that there, just in case someone someone gets tempted by the evil mistress that is silver. You know, I it's, I will say it's not as satisfying uh, doing the bow as something like the great axe or the the carving sword. I don't know. I, I'm I'm just not getting that same just pure satisfaction I normally get. Yeah, you know, and, and 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 that's coming from the heart right there too. Oh God! Can we just like, you know what? We're, we're just we're just gonna run through these. Not these though. That that's why you stalker boots right there. That's that's just. Oh, and we got the damage boost. Run through it. This this, this is when you take the opportunity and say thank you, world. Bro, everything that you've done for me. You are a kind individual. 
yeah it, it, we, we're we're murking right now i i love getting the red buff it really like like you you want to make your opportunity out of it you don't want to stay too long if we have a uh we actually have a mini boss right here this is perfect great great time to use this i think we don't want to waste it anywhere else okay you know what all right here we go here we go and then e all right so the re retaliates up while we're just sitting here taking damage we can r for a little bit and can keep popping off on him here now now so th th i think this is going to be a real testament to how well we're going to be doing here oh not even because we do have the buff so we're probably going to win this mm, you can't you can't stay in that guaranteed oh wow he actually got me i'm calling a little bit of shenanigans on that here we can probably just throw that on him as well it, 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 it's, it's all about kiting right now that's what we got to get done here oh dude the poison potion does so much damage by the way there it is yeah yeah you're like is he really gonna eat it he's gonna go down calculated 200 iq right here 35 from a blue chest you're not gonna be mad about that i don't think yeah i, I don't want to fight those guys that might be hilariously the death of me well not the death of me but like having to come back and kill those guys i don't think so i think it'll be fine they gave me another red you you sweethearts I, I i actually can't believe you're gonna do this for me you can give me another red I, I, I meant to aggro him earlier before i did anything else but you saw how well that worked out ow don't hit me again Ooh, almost all right this should get you close anyway you know you 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 uh you pro bow players you pro bow players what what w do you normally use in pve I'm, I'm i'm actually i'm actually pretty curious about that just because this is gonna hurt i think yeah all right hold on please get me out of there oh look at the look at the health from the the mercenary jacket just coming through uh what kind of w do you use because the other option i saw there it was the um that's unfortunate uh was the one that kind of shoots you back and kind of gives you some distance i would assume that one's more for pvp but i could see some usefulness in the pve side of things as well but you know i, I, don't, I don't i don't really know so yeah please don't treat this as like a don't treat well don't treat any of these tier eight and tier fives as like a a pure guide more of like you see what i'm doing take what i do take the good and add it to your runs take the bad and learn from it because that's exactly what i'm doing right now I, I I think the stalker boots might be a little cute, actually. You know, maybe not the best choice, but it does something for you. It might even set you up for some pretty good plays with the blink. And why not have a little bit of a damage boost when you do the blink? Also, they're very cheap. I think this this set of tier five that I have is like under four thousand silver. So yeah, like even if you wanted just to try out the the build a stalker stalker boots are a pretty affordable way of doing so all right eat garbage thank you i don't I, okay th this is definitely a single floor type of boss because like okay, it's a very long first floor i mean because y'all i mean i always skip like the first couple of rooms anyway so y'all don't even see this entire dungeon just the you know you know 90 percent of it but uh and we have too many bosses definitely just a, a single floor run here all right get out of there also the cooldown on this is pretty quick too so you know i i, I think i think you you don't have to just sit on it all the time you can use it pretty liberally for the uh for the damage boost i believe anyway and what i believe is what you should believe i was thinking maybe i should uh, i use retaliate there but i was thinking maybe i should have just like ate it as that way the damage back to him was just insane but you know that's kind of why i'm like i think hunterhood might be bad for this because i still don't want to really take the damage if I, if i don't have to you know there we go ggs i think this might be the final boss coming up right here this, this seems like a final boss area all right don't do it to me he did it to me 
Come on, hurry. We, 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 we really, we really got to do some damage here. Now we're doing something. I should probably set up those, uh, those shots a little bit better. Also, do y'all use the, the cone or do y'all use the, uh, the, the, the straight shot like I do here? Cause I was like, I mean, the cone makes sense, but you know, having this, that's a little bit poggers. By the way, those are about 70K silver. However, I think they're better used on a, a personal level. Like I, like, I'm gonna use that probably not for a video, but for like a personal use. Um, just because like you, you, you have a better chance of getting a lot better loot, but I probably, I'm probably not gonna do that in tier five gear. <laughs> just being just 100% real with you. It's not my style. Mm, I'm not really liking. There we go. Now, now we're now we're getting there. All right. But it's a blue chest final boss. That doesn't mean we're not about to get some pogged up loot. What that does mean is that you know what? We are gonna try. No, 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 no. I want to see if I can do this dungeon without the mage cow, just completely. And with that being said, you throw that on him. You throw that on him, and you start going off. And wh while he's casting, you should be channeling. I think. I think it's the best way of looking at that. Ooh. We're, dude, we're actually murking him. So, you're, you're, you're gonna make me say it, aren't you? You're, you're, damn it, you're gonna make me say it. Bows do a lot of damage. You, it, they might actually be pretty good in the big, in the long scheme of things, okay? There, I said it. I, I said it, are you happy? Okay. Maybe bows on a PVE. Oh, I mean, I mean they're fantastic on a PVP level, but maybe on a PVE level they're not as like Monka S for me. Maybe you can do some pretty good work with it. I don't know. I'm 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 just some some guy. Damn it. The the, the, the channels the channel's a bit annoying on that though. I wish it was like just like you just let it happen. But I mean it makes sense, right? Thematically, and that's a GG, boys. All right. I mean, like we got the dungeon map. That's already a, a poggers moment. Yeah, that, that sounds about right. All right, guys, that is it for the very first long bow episode of T8 with T5. I'll be back with the episode number two. Hopefully, hopefully we get some of the best loot you've ever seen. I'll see y'all next time. Oh, please, please like and subscribe and, and all that good stuff. See ya.